In the midst of a national housing shortage, one Wisconsin U.S. Senator is working on a bill to alleviate some of that strain. She sat down with political reporter Will Keneally, who has more. Senator Tammy Baldwin says she hopes to make housing more accessible in this bill. By doing so, cracking down on big investors. Well, we've found at various points in time that there have been uh, uh, out-of-state operators that have been buying vast numbers of single-family homes. So Baldwin wants to make a change. If a large investor or private equity firm buys up a bunch of property, for example, they can deduct part of that real estate on their taxes. But for people that buy up more than 50 properties, Baldwin wants to end those tax deductions. And so we really want to crack down on the unfair tax provisions uh, that uh, benefit these uh, private equity firms and these um, big uh, out-of-state operators. According to data from the National Realtors Association, around 13% of the home buying across the country in 2021 was by what they call those big institutional buyers. Wisconsin is slightly less than the national average at 12%, but some areas of the state see more of that than others. The impact has been making a home ownership out of reach for too many Wisconsinites. Baldwin added that the impact is not just in urban areas of the state. Um, whether that be in our bigger cities like Milwaukee, Madison, and Green Bay, but also uh, incredibly difficult uh, situations in rural areas uh, where businesses are growing, but the housing for workers uh, in those businesses is not available. Now, in the Wisconsin capital here, lawmakers say they are working on some legislation to increase Wisconsin's housing stock. We could see that come up later this fall. Reporting from the capital, Will Keneally, News 3 Now.